A Navy destroyer built at Bath Ironworks was in the middle of a rescue and missile attack off of Yemen on Sunday. The USS Mason helped rescue the crew of an Israeli flag tanker that had been taken over by Somali pirates in the Gulf of Aden on the Red Sea. The pirates escaped the ship, but the Navy later captured them. The USS Mason was launched in 2001 as the last ship to slide down the yard's historic inclined ways into the Kennebec River. Since that date, all the new destroyers at BIW have been launched by, a, by sliding into a dry dock. There was a big ceremony at the time of that last launch as it marked the end of an era in shipbuilding. The destroyer was actually named in honor of an earlier USS Mason built for World War II, which had been the first Navy ship to carry a predominantly black crew. In the incident on Sunday in the Red Sea, the Mason was under fire from cruise missiles launched from Yemen. The Mason launched several of its own missiles in return. The attacking cruise missiles fell into the sea, reportedly well short of the Mason and another Navy ship.